better. Dan Ives always tells me that Palo Alto is the table pounder, not CrowdStrike. Why? Look, I mean, Powell, to me, it's, that's the best way to play what we're seeing in cloud security, along with Zscaler. And I think that's a re-rating name, continues to be one I think is underappreciated by the street. And I think what we're seeing, just like Stephanie's talking, Fortinet, we see it in CrowdStrike, see it in Zscaler, you'll see it at RSA next week, cybersecurity, pillar of strength in this market, and in my opinion, it's an oversold sector. What about Microsoft? Let me just steer you in that direction as we wait on uh, on R H. You you basically tweeted today. This is my word, not yours. That it was a nothing burger. Well, why so? <laughs> because I view F X. The New York City cab driver knows that there's F X issues. So when this when they talk about F X, just like Salesforce, and also importantly, if they were seeing any softness, they would have cited it in that E K. They did not. The knee-jerk reaction down 3-4% in this jittery mark, market, I get it. It was an overreaction. I continue to view this is when the street already knows this. Moving forward, I view Microsoft on the cloud store. We are not seeing any cracks in the armor, just like Salesforce, just like we saw in Zscaler as well as Palo Alto. We're, we're going to get to uh, RH in just a moment because I, I see that it's out. Our, our Kate Rooney is, is going through that as we speak. Uh, but I do see a beat, though, on the top and the bottom line. Can we throw that up? guys and see what it's doing in, in the OT. Uh, I see also an additional $2 billion share buyback mm -hmm. uh, for RH. The issue, of course, is going to be the guidance. Uh, there's the stock. It's down a touch as the, the company looks uh, at uh, revenues.